From the cramped premises in Lagos, Nigeria, a team of about half a dozen artisans make between 200 and 300 bags every year. Zainab Ashadu is the brains behind the Zashadu brand. Her designs are a mixture of modern and ancient touch with most of the raw materials coming from cities around Nigeria. We work in a sustainable way um, and we do it in two ways. We either upcycle, which is what this is, or we work with sustainably produced leathers in Nigeria. Made in Africa, the shadow bags have won a small but loyal following locally. Private sales have been held in unexpected locations such as hotel suites or an upmarket yacht club. I like the fact that they're made by Nigerian in Nigeria. Um, they're quite expensive looking. They are expensive as well. Um, luxurious is probably what I should say. Um, I like the fact that they're what you don't find them everywhere. So not everybody will be carrying the same bag as you. Her brand has also established a presence in boutiques in London, Miami, Dublin and Johannesburg and most recently in Paris. The bags fetch between 150 to 800 euros there, though she has now gone global, as Zandu says, running a business in Lagos isn't easy. There's so many things that are challenging in, in Nigeria. I wouldn't discourage anybody from starting their own business or from doing bags or anything they wanted to do, but it's, you, have to be, you have to be very tough-skinned you have to be completely dedicated to what you're doing and really have a passion for it. A shadow is one of an increasing number of returning Nigerians or repats chancing their arm in their home country after years spent overseas. She's confident and knows that she's tapped into a trend that will soon be a household name. Robert Soy, CCTV.